Yo, what's up guys? So I'm finally off the flat roads and onto the onto the hills. Um, it's pretty early I think. Um, guessing around half six. Um, yeah. Tired and taking it really easy because it's been well the best part of a week since I did any serious running. Um, I want to make sure that uh, you know, I'm easing back into it and there's no real aches and pains afterwards. Anyway, I'm heading up there. Let's go. Yo, what's up guys? So I'm pretty much at the top of this hill now. Um, it's been pretty flat until the last kilometre or so. And then it absolutely shot up. Probably done about 100 metres in less than a kilometre. So it's pretty steep. Um, to be fair, I've got a cracking view. Check that out. Um, so I'm going to chill up here for two minutes and then head back down. Um, the only thing I've got to be weary of on a downhill now is that it's steep. So make sure I don't uh, come out with any problems with my knee or anything. But either way, I'm glad I got up early. I'm glad I got out to see this because I've been looking up at this mountain thinking, yeah, I want to see what it's like up there. Yo, what's up guys? So, I am 5k into my run and I finally hit the trails. Um, starting to get quite steep now. I've been eyeing up this mountain for a couple of days now. Had an extra day off yesterday, so I had enough of my legs to do it. Um, I think it's only about 20k, but it's it looks like a steep one. Um, so, running wise, I feel pretty good. That week off was brilliant. It made me feel like, uh, like I don't know, really relaxed. And I'm ready to get back into it again. So it's not only just a physical break, but a mental one as well. To feel I needed the physical break. My legs were killing after that long run. Um, so, this week I've done two 10Ks. Both quite hilly, but took them easy, and now it's about 20k today. Um, so not a massive week, but it's a good week to get back into it. I've only got three till the race, so I'm hoping to do a pretty big week next week. Um, with my long run being in Brecon, um, I want to go from the start line up to the top of Penavan and and down, I don't, I'm in two minds about whether to cut it short at 20k or go all the way to 35. It might be one of those days where I just see how I feel. Um, then the week after, I guess I start tapering. As long as my legs feel fresh from a day, then I reckon I'll be fine.
what's up guys so I'm at the top of the first climb and uh, I think there's only one more to go um, but I'm really glad I set up the route on my watch because I'd be all sorts of lost right now um, so let me show you where we are so I don't know if I'm going to the top of that one but the path is taking me this way. Right. Where the hell am I? Yo, what's up guys? So on my way back now, didn't make it to the top of there. Um, the, uh, the trail I was looking for didn't seem to exist. It seemed to be going basically straight up the side. There was a longer one that went all the way around the mountain, but I just haven't got the time today. So, I'm happy enough. I've got some wicked elevation and I've been out for hour 35 already. So, it's gonna be at least 2.45, maybe even three hours by the time I get back. Um, and everything's been feeling really good. Um, if I ever needed a bit of a confidence boosting run this was it because now well I've been going for an hour and a half assuming everything stays the same then three hours of running with lots of hills everything feels good you know no calf knee hamstring hip pain the only thing that hurts is my ankle that I rolled as I was running down the hill and again 